We've had the Champion in now installed for a year. It's almost exactly a year. The main reason for choosing it was because the way it operates. Uh, we, we felt that it was a, a well-built parlor and it would last a long time. So again, we're, we're just simply sold on the product. It automatically indexes. Just a bit about the milking unit. Uh, we're really satisfied. We like the way the, the, the bowl type is designed, which was kind of a new concept. We looked at the numerous others, and we like the way the, the inflations are, are in, the, in the bowl there, no stem. And we also recognize the benefit of um, the sequencing gates being hanging on to the, to the rail rather than being cemented in the concrete. It's an important feature as well because of less cleaning, easier to clean. And we also like the durability of the Champion, the way it's uh, bolted into the concrete and uh, the heavy steel that's being used in it. Uh, we like the takeoff. Takeoff works really well. And as far as uh, cleaning, it uh, hasn't been a problem. Just And our, our, our jetters, the way we have them, our washing procedure here, that that is real convenient. I know it uh, was, an, was an extra, was an option. Uh, of course, added a little bit to the cost, but it was definitely worth it. Uh, and as far as the flushing, also the deck flushing, gutter flushing, those all have really, really worked well. As far as uh, products that we use, like soaps and dips, they're all strictly uh, deal of our products. Pre-dip and a post-dip, and also an acid rinse and detergent. Uh, we we stick with them because we know they're they're good products. It's a time that my wife and I look forward to. Actually, most of the time it's pleasant here. It's warm enough, and you know, summertime with the fans running, it's cool enough to be comfortable in here. And it's one of the nicer places to be besides the house. So the social factor does, does enter in there, yeah. As far as uh, milking procedure, uh, two people in the parlor just about all the time. Uh, we, we strip each cow and then we pre-dip and we do that four cows in a row. We come back and we wipe those four cows and we come back and we start attaching units. As far as the operator, uh, the height is, is just right for most of us. And we are on every five week uh, schedule to change inflations, which our dealer does for us, the route, route man does for us. And we also are on a six month uh, schedule as far as main maintenance on anything that needs to be replaced every six months. And then those items that get replaced every year those are also listed out and they're all pre-priced out as well. We know what it's going to cost us uh, every six months to upgrade or to replace these items and also every one year items. It has allowed us to, to increase our profit, increase our total revenue, and yet not increase our labor. And whenever you can do that, I think it's a good thing. Uh, for example, we can, instead of milking 100 cows, 
like we did before, we're milking 170, and with with about the same amount of time and almost the same amount of labor. So we've definitely become more efficient that way. Even though there is a cost involved with upgrading, sooner or later it has to be done. Whether uh, you have a stall barn or whether you have an old parlor or something, it, it just only lasts so long. So even though there's a cost involved and there's interest costs involved with that, it's still, in, in the long run, it still is a, a good paying proposition. Uh, we can't really single out any certain product uh, or any even two products. It's kind of the whole, the whole system has to kind of function together. So again, I almost have to uh, go back to uh, quality products and quality service and making the whole system work and making it a profitable system. And uh, so that's, that's where we ended up with uh, probably the main reasons for choosing the champion. Thank you.